Hi, I'm Prani and I'm an indie game developer. I've been playing games since the early 80s. When I was a kid, I used to um, go over to a friend's house and play Space Invaders on her brother's Atari. I used to have lots of fun doing that. When I was in grade seven, my mother and father gave me a Commodore 64. That pretty much just sealed my love for games and I've been playing them ever since. When I had the Commodore 64, I wanted to be a computer programmer. That was just a big dream of mine for a while, but then something happened and I put that aside for quite a few years. My sister was studying film when she was in high school and, you know, I wasn't really interested in making films back in those days, but because I loved doing art, she used to drag me in to help with various art elements that she needed in those films. But it wasn't until I found out that Peter Jackson was filming Lord of the Rings in New Zealand that I decided I wanted to get into the film industry. My first job at Word Workshop was to work in a small team assembling the armour for the Gondorian army. I was given the opportunity to work on set, which was the first on set experience that I had. I also worked on Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe. I was a senior Weta armourer by that stage. Even though I loved working on films, I felt like I needed a change. And because I'd always loved games, loved working on a computer, um, I just decided that I wanted to go into that direction. I searched out all the degrees and courses available in teaching game design. Ended up at RMIT University doing a Bachelor of Arts in Games Graphic Design. The course was really interdisciplinary in lots of ways. You did everything from, you know, learning basic programming to design, design concepts, art concepts, digital painting. Since finishing my degree, I found it hard to get my foot in the door into a gaming studio, but I decided that even though that's disheartening, it's not going to make me stop making games. So for the past three years, I've participated in the Global Game Jam. So Global Game Jam is a international event. A heap of developers sign up to do it and they've got 48 hours to make a game. This year for Global Game Jam, I worked with two other friends to make a game called Rescue Squad. Rescue Squad is a multiplayer local cooperative game. Two to three players control one spaceship and have to rescue little space chickens that are floating around. For me, I think one of the best parts of being an indie dev is the creativity that it allows. It's really, really good to go out into the world, experience things, um, explore different hobbies, different interests. It brings a whole lot more to the game. If you really, really want to make games, then the best thing to do is just make them.